Our guest tonight is an actor, activist, and Avenger who swaps Infinity Stones for Infinity and Beyond in Lightyear from Disney and Pixar. Shall we play a game? No, thank you. Are you sure? I can create a game specifically for you, based on your exact personality profile. Hey, listen, Socks, buddy, I'm pretty tired, so I'm gonna go ahead and hit the rack. Of course. <sighs> I can provide sleep sounds if you like. I have several options. Summer night, ocean paradise, whale calls. No, no, white noise is fine. Very well. Good night, Socks. Good night, Buzz. Lightyear opens in theaters June 17th. Please welcome Chris Evans. If it isn't enough to already be Captain America, now you get to be Buzz Lightyear, too. <laughs> what a life you're yeah, leading. Yeah, it's an embarrassment of riches. Are you traveling all over the world promoting it? Yeah, well, we're about to. We're here first, and, gotcha. then, and then the whirlwind begins. Do you like doing that? Do you like going to other countries? And have you? do you get mobbed in places you never would have expected you might? Yeah, 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 sometimes. Like where? Well, well, I mean, Marvel certainly kind of breaks you into that. But, you know, I, I actually, one of the crazier experiences didn't have anything to do with Marvel actually we did a movie uh, a few years back called Snowpiercer oh yeah right yeah, yeah. thank you it's a good one yeah so nice uh, and and the director's Korean so we went to South Korea and uh, we landed we we were coming out of the airport and it was a zoo just a mat like we were the Beatles people were screaming and they had one little rope to to stop people and that rope just got <laughs> Bulldozed, and uh, very quickly we were we were surrounded. It, it kind of got a little nerve wracking for a minute, and you know, security came in and whisked us out of there. And producers later that day were like, "Man, we heard what happened at the airport. We're so sorry. It's, it's, that's never going to happen again." And I said, "Hey, you know, it's not a big deal." Uh, and then a couple days later, we we left Korea. I get back to the airport, uh, and as I'm walking in, uh, there was a van behind us. Out of this van steps 25 to 30 giant, giant Korean men, all wearing suits, and, and they, they, they stand in, in a circle around me, holding hands, <laughs> and, and they're, 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 they're walking me into the airport. What? <laughs> Not one fan showed up. <laughs> Nobody. I was all by myself. That's probably walking. for the best. Yeah. Why? Just like, oh my god. <laughs> and you try to tell them, guys, it's it's not a. But you know, they they were there mission. to work, and this that was, was it. This was through security, and and to the gate. These guys. <laughs> so it's great to have a new uh, Pixar movie coming to yeah. the theaters. Yeah. There's um, some confusion about this movie, uh, partially fueled by you. You posted the <laughs> trailer to the movie, and everybody was excited. Yeah, and yeah, then, yeah. like a half an hour later, you followed it up. <laughs> All right, well. Writing, um, and just to be okay. clear, this isn't Buzz Lightyear the toy. This is the origin story of the human Buzz Lightyear that the toy is based on. <laughs> now, just, okay. <laughs> Please explain. You know it's a shame. I proofread that like five times. <laughs> <laughs> like to me, I was like, it can't be any clearer than that. <laughs> it, it's really a shame. I mean, it's, it's, it's a tough thing to try and explain via, via, via tweet, but as soon as I sent that. Can you explain it in person? Because uh, I, I as mean, far I'll as, try again. <laughs> as far as I understand, Tim Allen voiced the toy Buzz Lightyear. That's right. And you are the real Buzz Lightyear? That's right. Well, you know what it is? So, so I, listen, I, I'm a massive, massive Pixar fan. And uh, when my team first called me to tell me that, that this was a possibility, when, when you get a Which call... Which team? The Celtics, you mean? <laughs> Sorry. God, that was like the most Hollywood thing. When my team called, uh, you know, my, my agents. Um, yeah. And when everybody's on the call, you know it's either good news or, or really bad oh, news. Oh, right. Yeah, right. <laughs> uh, but, but they said, uh, you know, uh, Pixar wants to talk to you about a job, and they said, the only thing we know is Buzz Lightyear. And I said, okay, you know, Tim Allen's Buzz Lightyear, how's this gonna go? And I went up and I met with them, and uh, Angus, the director, uh, had, a, had a 
PowerPoint presentation. And, and it began by him saying, uh, so when I was a kid, I loved Star Wars. And quick, the first, the first slide was, you know, five-year-old Angus covered in Han Solo gear. And, and he said it was just his whole world. He had all the toys and his friends loved it. And he said that when he first saw the first uh, Toy Story and when Andy got Buzz Lightyear and all his friends knew who Buzz was, he wondered what was the movie in their world that they saw that made Buzz such, a, what such an iconic... What an interesting thing to think of. Yeah. And I said, OK, OK, I can wrap my head around that. That yeah. makes sense. So, yeah. yeah that, that, that's what it is. This is the movie... If only you tweeted that, you know? <laughs> I'm going to save so many people so Did much hardship. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can't wait to see it when my, my kids are going to eat it up. No doubt oh, about good, it. Good. Speaking of kids, we're going to play a little game of dodge basketball. Yeah, do you know I've what heard. this is? Are you I, sure I, you want to do this? No, not really. Okay. I haven't shot a basketball. Because I'm like going to tell year. you, Chris Pratt got one in the face and then right away, right in the nuts. But last did he beat time. you? He did not beat me. He did not, no. All right, because I just saw a clip where you didn't put up any points at all. Well, that's probably what's going to happen again tonight. But, well, all right, we'll see what happens. You don't know until you play the game. My <laughs> ear opens in theaters June 17th. Chris Evans and I are going outside to play